Hi folks and thanks for joining me. You can see I've got the Airline 62316 from 1936 back on the bench. Time to uh, check the resistors and get all of the out of tolerance resistors replaced. In addition, get these old uh, paper caps out. The electrolytics, you guys saw the previous video there where I uh, prepped the existing cans for the uh, new electrolytics. The uh, power transformer has still uh, not been completed on the lead dress. And the uh, tuning condenser itself is out of the uh, circuit as well. So uh, let me get started here on the uh, resistors. Start checking those and uh, see what I can uncover. And as I find uh, issues or correct issues, I'll bring you guys along for updates. Thanks for watching. I think I'll start up here in this right corner with the uh, resistors and check those against the schematic. And everywhere I have a tie down location with an existing capacitor, I'll go ahead and replace the uh, capacitor at the same time. Just something I like to do for folks that are new in the hobby is just helpful and simple. If the schematic itself or the diagram does not show an underneath side view of the uh, receiver, I always like just doing a kind of a crude hand drawing to show the uh, tube placement. So when I'm referencing back to the uh, schematic in the radio, I'm not confusing myself when looking uh, underneath the uh, chassis. Okay, my first uh, mystery component, a capacitor here, paper cap 100-37. I do not see that listed on the uh, schematic, unless I've overlooked it. So uh, we'll check that later. Looking at the uh, resistor here, the uh, 9K, you can see listed as 9M on the uh, schematic. Back in the uh, early 30s, that was the nomenclature used, but this is 9000 ohm. So you can see we're just a little high. Take 11.2 divide by uh, 9, you can see we're about 24% uh, above the uh, rated Okay, a few resistors uh, replaced that were out of tolerance at various locations here in the circuit. And capacitors as well um, replaced up to this point. Still got to do the uh, left side of the chassis looking at it from my viewpoint. And uh, you can see here was uh, an audio input source that they had. That's why that hole was drilled in the chassis. I'm going to uh, remove that. See how they had that uh, connected to the circuit just for uh, my edification. And I uh, just continue to work my way over here to the uh, left side where it's a little bit more congested. Check the rest of these resistors and get the uh, remaining paper capacitors out before I tackle the electrolytics here. Interesting how this uh, modification was made. You can see the uh, wire that was used to jump over to the uh, RCA connector itself. Not even soldered, just twisted around the uh, resistor here. Okay folks, my uh, point of leaving off for uh, today's efforts. Again, I'll get back on this thing when uh, time permits. I've got the uh, out of tolerance resistors replaced with the exception of this one right here. And it's tied to this mess here you can see on the B plus side. This uh, resistor is the uh, wrong value. It should be 9K. Somebody put a 19,000 ohm resistor in. So uh, we'll swap that out. Still got to get this paper cap out. This particular capacitor is not shown on the schematic, but I just placed it back as is for now. So uh, kind of my leave off point for now. Just a little quick update on my progress on the 62316 airline from 1936. Thanks for watching, folks.